Hello everybody! Air missile war in Ukraine. Last night nine two ninety fives were airborne over the Caspian Sea. From here. Uh, they release a total of uh, 14 X101 555 missiles at Ukraine. Uh, 10 Chahids uh, was launched in Ukraine. At least one hit an apartment building in Kriverich, killing at least 10 civilians. Wounding many others, Russian army is focusing a ground in number of the, its tactical strikes to the Zaporizhia front line. Between others, its Su-36 are deploying uh, MPK guide uh, bombs to hit suspected storage sites 20-40 kilometers behind Ukraine's lines. On 9 June, the Ukrainian army exploited the opportunity to hit the headquarters of the group of force Dnepr uh, in a hotel in Gnitschesk with storm, with storm shadow missiles. Words, the Russian army suffered hundreds of losses. Battle of Donbass Kupiansk and Svatoe uh, Russian climb a new Ukrainian offensive in this era in the making. There is no beef from the other side. Bakhmut Ukrainian army is continuing to grind north and south of the ruined town, causing heavy losses to the defeating VSRF in the process. In the north have reaches Berhivka, but in the south the fighting is still outside Klishivka. Avdivka is diversionally uh, from Ukraine attacks uh, at three points, two at nose uh, and one south the town. Zaporizhia front. Orihiv. The 33rd and 47th uh, brigade uh, patched from Lobkove in southwestern direction at the way to Ludove and have fight with Russian army. At the 58th Brigade to uh, bring the 742nd Spetsnaz Brigade from 2nd to the 1st line defense. Ironically, all the attention on both the Russian and Western media is focused on the sector because uh, there is Leopards uh, here, uh, here. Uh, and uh, Russian can show so many photos and videos. Pole, similar, the CEO manage only minor dance in the Russian defenses. Velika Novosilka, or what the Russian call the Vremivka Bilge. This is from where uh, there are best news from the Ukrainian army the last few days. Essentially, a group of motorized infantry and mechanized infantry formation of the SU breached through the win in an specular infantry attack and is ever since running amok in the Russian rear. The Zisu run a series of attack along the eastern side of uh, Mokri Yali River and uh, <clears throat> usually starting in southern direction before turning west and then north straight into the Russian back. Best of all, the river is the stream between the uh, 58 combined arms army. This caused the Russian entirely unprepared and caused them massive losses. Example, the first 
to get overrun the VSRF garrison of Neskuchne here uh, counted uh, 200 uh, people. Uh, 60 were confirmed killed, 2-3 captured, the rest ran away. It was similar in uh, Blahodatne and Starojeve, Makarinka and Staromajorske Urojajne. Eventually, the 6th Motor Rifle Brigade and the 366th Naval Infantry Brigade were manual and fell apart. <clears throat> As their scattered columns began uh, filling down the road running the west of the Mokri Mokriyal to Staromlinivka. Uh, and they lost their position. Something similar uh, happened with the Russians brought their operational reserve from the 3rd defense line from here uh, up to the Staromlinivka uh, and ordered into a counterattack on the 10th June. This move was detected by a Ukrainian army on the times and the division heavily shelled it already while preparing suffering numerous losses and tanks, armored fighting, vehicles and guns. Nevertheless, the Russian counterattacked. One prong went around Staromajorsky. One prong went around Staromajorsky to the nose and attempted to recover Storozheve. There it ran into the infantry uh, of the Ukrainian territorial defense and was ambushed suffering numerous losses. Another went east of the rear and tried to hit the ZSU uh, in Urojaina from the east, but ran into abuses and mines and suffered heavy losses. Moreover, Ukrainians apparently then liberated Novodonetsk and hit that Russian counterattack into its eastern flank. Finally, either on 10th and 11th June, the 127th counterattacked to Makarivka and suffered heavily losses again embayed in Ukrainians to uh, relate their advance and reach Staromlinivka yesterday the morning ever since the, the bitter fighting inside this village. Moreover, Ukrainians have hit the headquarter of uh, CAA killing here, killing uh, its chief of staff, Major General Sergei Gorchanov said to have been a skilled commander. Vugledar. There are lots of reports um, about Vugledar, but uh, no moves, uh, uh, only some moves uh, from Vugledar to Volnovaha. Apparently, this might have reached a Blahodatne area back on 7th uh, June before a uh, Russian army launched a counterattack. The counterattack might have been partially successful in slowing down Ukrainian advance, but was then stopped and the troops in question redeployed into defense position south Volnovaha. Now we see that Ukrainian armies start going to uh, direction Mariupol.